Hello, my name is Ellen McCaw and I'm a Researcher Services Librarian at the University of New England Library. In this short video, we will look at some common resources used for finding a journal to publish in. Start where you already are. Where are you already reading? People often publish where they read, so this can be a good place to start. This will also help give you a feel for the journal, such as the subject areas they publish, the types of research they publish, articles, literature reviews, reports, etc as well as the length, type font and referencing style. All of these are important to know before submitting an article. Check the publisher's website. The journal or publisher website should have clear, well-presented information on what they publish, which databases index the journal, any bibliometric data such as the journal impact factor, who is on the editorial board, the type of peer review conducted, the turnaround time for articles being accepted or rejected, and who to contact for assistance. This information should be clear, well written and easy to find. Double check a publisher's claims. Once you check the journal or publisher website, you should double check this information by looking at such independent resources as Think Check Submit, Think Check Attend, Ulrich's Web, Sherpa Romeo and even a quick Google search. Think Check Submit is a website that asks you a series of questions to check the reputation and ethical practice of a publication in order for you to feel confident about the journal you have selected. Think Check Attend was recently launched to assist researchers in finding appropriate conferences to attend. Ulrich's Web provides a variety of details on a journal such as how often it is published and which databases index the journal. And Sherpa Romeo provides information regarding copyright, embargo periods, data collection, and the type of peer review the journal uses. Know your rights and responsibilities as an author. Knowing your rights and responsibilities as an author is very important. You should be able to confidently answer such questions as who owns the copyright to your published work, as well as who owns the data underpinning your research and where it is being stored. This will also help if you're unsure if a journal is practicing unethical publishing. Have a conversation. Ask questions. Having conversations with your supervisors, peers, mentors and librarians is an important part of the process. Often the ins and outs of academic publishing is learned by trial and error, so never underestimate the advice that people who have done this before can offer you. People will have a variety of experiences that they can share with you to better inform your decisions and help you to prepare for your next step. Some miscellaneous points. The process from I should publish a paper to I've published a paper can be a long one. Be prepared to wait several months to find out whether you have been accepted and for the peer review process to take place, and perhaps even longer for your article to be assigned a journal issue. Postgraduate students can book a consultation with their researcher services librarians to further discuss selecting an appropriate journal in consultation with their supervisor. And lastly, UNE Library has a Choose Your Own Adventure book about academic publishing that goes into further detail on this topic. This is in the downloadable links in the notes below. Hopefully this website has helped explain part of the process and some of the resources you can use when finding a publisher for your research. A transcript of this video and links to websites and resources discussed is in the downloadable Word document below.